Oh, Grat Triple R. I have a Space Invaders, not in my arcade, but one of these minis. Uh, pretty cool. Got it for like $2.50 from the thrift store. I do like the side art of the classic Space Invaders. Uh, it's not in color, but the, in the original Space Invaders was a weird like blue and white setup anyway. The screen is messed up, as you can see. So there's a permanent blotch over here, and it looks like it got pressed in in the middle. So, just unfortunate, but it stands up, doesn't look too bad. Uh, along with the others in my collection. Uh, three double A's, I believe. And it does work, which is nice. So you can still play it. Just when the flying saucer goes up top, maybe a little more difficult to see. Um, let's start it up here. Maybe. Oh, man. Well, at least wait till the flying saucer shows up so you can hear it. And response is okay. Even with that screen a little messed up, you can still play it. There it is. Let's see if we can get it. No, oh, come on. Dude. So that is a quick Space Invaders thrift pickup to add to my little arcade collection that I have now. So I have Burger Time, Centipede, Seamus Pac-Man, Frogger. Now, Space Invaders, you know, for two dollars fifty cents. Sometimes they're three fifty. Uh, I think they're worth it if you're a classic arcade game fan. So the art is really cool on here, and it does still work, which is nice. So thanks for watching Triple R. Have a good day or night, wherever you are, and be sure to like, comment, subscribe. It does help, and I'm supposed to say that, and I forget a lot, <laughs> but it really does help, and I do appreciate it. So thanks for watching Triple R. Have a good day or night, wherever you are.